people of the internet did you miss me or did you even notice I was gone because I was I have unfortunately not had actually that's an excuse I just have not been able to make videos plain and simple for a couple of reasons we are being attacked by cicadas there are thousands of cicadas in our backyard in the streets in the trees pretty much everywhere so it's almost impossible for me to make any DIYs in the back porch back patio area there are thousands of them and they fly and I just don't want to deal with that so I have not been able to make DIYs or larger projects because of that reason and also I have had so much going on in my personal life that I have just not been in the right state of mind to be creative or to want to make any videos and that's probably when I should make videos so that I can have an escape but I don't want to make videos just to make videos now I don't want to share too much of my personal life because there are too many people being cancelled out there and your girl's not trying to get cancelled before she even gets started so I'm just gonna leave it at I have been dealing with a lot of personal situations whatever you want to call it and I don't really want to talk about those on the internet just because the internet is a scary place and whatever you put out into the internet is there forever so I figured let's get out of this slump that I'm currently in and let's just record a day in my life and just kind of what I get up to. I have also noticed that a lot of YouTubers who post a day in the life on YouTube are so bougie and are so extra. Like, come on, half of us sometimes barely even get out of our pajamas. Nope. So it's not very realistic when they're traveling to another state and then back home and then flying and then vacationing and on just like a random regular day in my life half of us don't do that so this video is just gonna be very mundane that's what I did today so I just wanted to share it with you guys and I hope you like it and I hope you also subscribe and you also follow me over on my Instagram but let's just go ahead and get started Look at Coco. Hi Coco. Coco is the boss of the house, hence why she sleeps on two stacks of comfort. When I tell you she runs this house, she runs this house. Go! What up? Good morning. It is Monday and I'm sure I've already told you what the purpose of this video is. However, I want to start off with something very important. I've noticed that a lot of people on YouTube are always apologizing for the way they look when they are not put together. For example, if you don't do your hair or don't do your makeup, you don't have to apologize to anyone for the way that you look. I obviously don't look put together. I just woke up, my face is still swollen. I'm not going to say sorry for the way I look because there's no need. Everything starts with you. Empower yourself. Feel confident in whatever you're wearing, whatever way you look. So, I just wanted to start the video officially by saying that. Anyway, this is me in the morning and usually on a Monday I wake up, I look at my emails, then I kind of just hang out for a minute until my gym class but right now I think Louie wants to play with her bubbles so I'm gonna go get that set up for her so let me show you what it looks like Louie is the only dog that I've ever had that actually enjoys playing with bubbles I mean by enjoy I mean she goes crazy for them good morning Lulu this is Louie for those of you that don't know this is her little brother, Bruno, licking her eye boogers. Oh, she's got some big old eye boogers. What? What? What, my beautiful girl? 
This is a bubble machine that we use. Anthony ordered it off Amazon. I believe it was like $29. So yes, it's pretty expensive. And yes, we've had to reorder it, reorder it a couple of times. But that little face and that little tail is worth it. Right, Louie? Usually what I do is I just get this bubble solution ready and then I pour it into this little shark dolphin thing and let it run for, I want to say about 10 minutes, 15 minutes. I'm telling you, she loves this. So if you have a big dog, check and see if they enjoy playing with bubbles because this is honestly a good workout for them. This big guy is only five months old. He's a handful. He loves hugs, as you can see. Ruby's not a fan of him. <laughs> what, Stinky? What? Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love your hugs. You guys will see how wild she goes. There's also freaking cicadas everywhere. I put it on this little stand because... Sometimes it tips over. Bruno doesn't like bubbles, so he always gets in her way, but eventually she figures it out. As long as you're away from us, I'm captive in my heart. And there's a good chance we won't survive. You guys, there are cicadas everywhere on our porch. Honestly, I'm pretty sick and tired of them. I respect them, I respect their life cycle. But I just, I just can't with them anymore. So far, I have washed the dishes, and I just want to show you guys my professionalism. Look at this. I do believe the many years of practice that I had living with my parents led to this. But don't tell me that you need anything because that ain't going to happen. Quick update because you guys have not seen how the living room looks like now. It looks a little bit different from the previous living room makeover. And that's because I just wanted to have the TV on this side so that the window wouldn't cast a glare on it when it was over here. So really what I just did is I just flip flopped everything. The couch was back here and the TV was here and I just kind of swapped everything. And for right now, I really like the way this looks. So my next task or my next chore is to pretty much sweep and then mop everything because with three dogs, it's almost impossible to have clean floors and I've just had to accept that especially when you have white floors. I'm gonna be changing to go to the gym. I'm just gonna get changed for the gym. Do nothing with me. Do nothing with me. I just got back from the gym. So now I'm actually gonna wash my face and get ready for the day because I have a couple of errands to run and hopefully I can maybe read for an hour, but I'm just gonna wash my face. The lighting in here is horrible, so that's why I have to put the camera out of my eyes. That's why I have to put the camera here. But anyway, after the gym, I like to wash my face. If I sweat a lot, I like to take a body shower. But of course, I'm not going to show you guys that. 
Then I just add my skin care. I can never say that. My skin care. And I'm good for the day. Can't really open my eyes, but I'm going to take a body shower and then I will continue with the rest of the video. Now I'm going to be making a smoothie. I just realized that my smoothie is going to be a little sad actually because we don't have that many frozen fruits and really all I'm working with is a banana. Anyway, I was using almond milk. However, I found out that it's not that good for the environment. So then I switched to oat milk and this one is 100% vegan. I do use this protein powder. I know for a fact that I don't consume a lot of protein. Additionally, I like to add some fiber into my smoothies, you know, for that extra boost when the boost is not happening. <laughs> You know what I mean. Also, I'm gonna be adding some spinach. I know I know it sounds kind of weird to add spinach into your fruit smoothie, but when it's in there, I can't even taste it, and I kind of want to eat this up before it goes bad, so that's why I'm gonna be adding that. I wanna show you guys these veggie straws that I found at Aldi. Dare I say, better than potato chips. They're not as bad, but they taste just as good. As you can see, I slapped on some makeup and I'm ready to head out. I just feel like whenever I wear makeup, I don't just sit around. I feel ready to go. So I have to go to Forever 21 to return some things. And I also have to go buy Bubble Solution for Louie's Bubble Machine because she is running super low. She's down to her last bottle. And if I don't buy any now, it's gonna be sold out everywhere because it is summertime. So let's just go. If you want to read, I would highly suggest to check out the book section in the dollar store. I have honestly found some really good ones. For example, this one, I'm going to be taking this one and this one. They had lots of cute things, but I did not buy anything. I simply returned what I had to return. I looked around and then I came home. the whole video thank you so much for watching the whole thing i would also appreciate it if you would subscribe give it a thumbs up but also follow me over on my instagram anyway i just want to say thank you for sticking around and for subscribing to my channel there are a lot of new people anyway i hope you stick around and continue watching my videos if there are any videos that you would like to see please let me know I definitely, definitely enjoy sit down videos, but then I'm like, what do I talk about? So if you have ideas in regards to things you want me to talk about, or if you have Q and A's that you would like for me to also make, just let me know. I love making videos, but sometimes I don't know what to make videos about. So please help me out and I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next one. See ya.